The day is July 16th, I think, and it is my second time going surfing. So it's kind of my new um, half year resolution. I've been uh, looking to do more hobbies. So surfing and pole dancing has been my other one. And I just started surfing. So this is gonna be a very fun new experience. Let's see how this goes. My dad actually loves to fish and um, we, I told him as soon as I get into surfing, dude, me and you, you go surfing, I go fishing. Ideally, I'd like to surf more in the mornings, but I just got a new board today. It's the Jerry Lopez ones that you hear a lot about for good beginner ones. And I actually see another surfer here that has the same board. So him and I, beginners. <laughs> I'm actually using my boyfriend's um, previous one when he was learning how to surf and it fits absolutely perfect on me. <laughs> Got back. All I said was, I just want one. Just want one good catch, one good surf. I can't even think correctly. I want to stand up once, and I was able to stand up once. I was probably only out for like 15 to 30 minutes, um, and I definitely need a better system of getting out of my wetsuit. I had to walk all the way to a rinse off station, walked up back to my truck, and I realized I should just go get one of those uh, rinse off things. That way, I can just do it all in one place. Plus this board is huge and there's no handles on the Jerry Lopez one. So you have to like struggle to keep it up. So I tried to keep my composure and uh, now I'm just gonna try to take it off my wetsuit. All right, recap on the whole first session. It wasn't bad. I really enjoyed it because I saw that there were other surfers out there, but it wasn't like crowded where I knew I could possibly hurt somebody if I just like fell off, um, which is why I only want to go when there's not a lot of people. Plus, because I'm learning, it just helps with like the embarrassment in case people are watching. Like when I first went in, there was a couple that stood right in front of me and just like stared at me and waited until I caught something. And I fell like over and over again. And the next time I looked up, they were gone. And I was like, I don't know if they were watching me for a show or, you know, I don't know what they were expecting. So. Um, regardless, I'm pretty much over, I'm not, you know, like scared that people are going to judge me because of course, like people that know how to surf already know that I'm a beginner and people that don't know how to surf, once they see me surf, will be like, oh, either she sucks or she's a beginner. And like, that's it. That's the worst thing that could happen. So, um, I'd give this first time, even though I was only out for like 15 to 20 minutes, probably like a six out of ten um i was very nervous going in and also like i said earlier my whole takedown of taking out the wetsuit and rinsing off i wish i had a hose and i think my dad has one because he's he loves to fish and um he has like all that equipment to like rinse off his boots um on the go so i'm gonna ask him if i could borrow that when i do go out and i'll make an update video the next time i do go out because i do want this to be a somewhat consistent thing the goal is really just to have fun and of course to like stand up and gradually get better but i'm not going to be too hard on myself if i just you know only foam board only do it on this i don't even think this is considered a long board because i know that in the surfer community if you say i'm a long boarder but you're a beginner you know it's going to piss people off so that's my overall vlog of the day thanks for watching and i'll see you next time